Hello, beautiful soul. I'm Sharon Spenson, Spenson Hypnosis, and welcome to my series, What Hypnosis Is and What Hypnosis Isn't, as told from the perspective of a hypnotist. I'm talking about pain today, and if you missed the first part, um, part A, go back. I talk a little bit about how I help clients with pain how I help them to get that relief. And in many cases, completely be free of the discomfort. What are some of, what are some examples of things that hypnotists can treat for pain relief? Well, I can, um, I can't speak for all hypnotists, but I can speak for myself and different people that I've supported and helped. I think of um, one client who she was in constant pain and so much pain that uh, she couldn't do the things that she loved, like exercising, dancing, moving around because of um, off the charts inflammation. Well, from our work together, she was able to release that discomfort, to feel comfortable in, as she put it, her own skin again, and to do things like exercise classes and, and dancing. And she went on to, I think it was rollerblading outside. So much more is possible for us. Or I think of another client who had a pain pump put in because she had this constant pain that wouldn't go away after a surgery that she'd had. Well, I, I think we worked together like six sessions and she was free of the discomfort and was able to get the pain pump taken out. Yay, wow. Or another client who had a progressive incurable illness and autoimmune disorder that that was one of his first successes as we worked together was feeling relief and comfort in his body. Oh, and, and he said that was huge. He was eventually able to get off um, most of his medications. I don't know if he eventually got off his very last medication and to turn around his, his immune disorder and to claim and take his life back. Wow, I think of another woman who had phantom pain, who was able to experience dramatic relief, all from the power of our minds, that so much more is possible. I've worked with, and if you hear the, the background noise, it's a beautiful sunny day. I'm so appreciative of that. And snow is melting off the roof right now. I'm recording this in the month of February. And I think of uh, different clients that have come and this one usually releases relatively quickly. So for instance, um, one or two sessions for migraine headaches, where we release the pressures that the client feels, we let go and reframe things in a new way. And then they get a hypnosis recording to follow up it's amazing what hypnosis can do. I think of two clients where we did work for post-surgery. So, so we did it beforehand when they were having some major surgeries and we imagined it instead like this kind of spiritual spa vacation. Those clients gave reports back of, I didn't have any pain or discomfort. I didn't even need the medication huge stuff so if you've been hesitating doing hypnosis explore that as an option especially if you are doing things that aren't working for you all right so if if you're interested in working with me go to my website, svensonhypnosis.com and get your free gift. I've got a hypnosis meditation to guide you into a relaxed state and to let go of the different mental junk that doesn't serve us. If you want to explore working with me, email me and ask me to 
to get online with you on Zoom or do a phone chat and I can tell you more how hypnosis can help you out. All right. Well, I hope you enjoyed this this uh, video. I hope it gave you more clarity and guidance. Oh, and, and one question I just thought of that often comes up is, well, you can do this over the phone and by Zoom? Yes, there are some exceptions to the rule. Again, request a chat with me, uh, email me, svensonhypnosis at gmail.com, and we can set something up. But for the most part, yes, I have worked with people on Zoom, I have worked with people by phone, and there have been some beautiful results. Okay, blessings and love.